They're at the post for race 15. The Illinois State Fair Championship for three-year-old pacing Colts and Geldings, the Governor George H. Ryan Trophy, and a $60,000 purse all on the line. They're at the post. Gates rolling. More championships tomorrow. First race at 12 noon. 15 more heats of harness racing. Today's final race, less than an eighth of a mile from the start. Here they come. They're off and pacing. There goes Tribal Chief out for the lead. Rattle and Rock is also flashing early speed, followed by Big Green Machine, who gets away third toward the inside. And then Sport Czar, who angles out toward the center of the track and fourth, heading on to the first turn. Rattle and Rock moves up and gets the lead by a length and a half. Tribal Chief settles in second. Big Green Machine goes third by two. Then Diamond Man is fourth. Major McIntosh goes fifth. Sport Czar is parked in sixth at the quarter mile mark, followed by the fast lane. Conspicuous absence, Cole Hearted Ransom and Walter Brown. 27 and 2 was the time for the opening quarter. Rattle and Rock leads it. Now, here comes Diamond Man moving up on the outside. Diamond Man from third to second. And now to challenge for the lead. Diamond Man puts ahead in front. Rattle and Rock goes second by a length and a half. Followed by Major McIntosh, third on the outside. Tribal Chief gets shuffled back and forth. And on the outside, the fast lane moves up a closer fifth, three lengths off the lead. The half in 55 and 3. Big Green Machine is coming off the rail from 6th. He's four lengths from the front. Followed by Cole Hearted Ransom. Conspicuous absence. Walter Brown and Sport Czar. On the turn. Diamond Man has made the top. Major McIntosh draws alongside. Half length separating them. Rattle and Rock is locked on the rail in third. Anderson looks to his right. He sees Dave McGee drawing alongside with the fast lane. Top four separated by two lengths. Off three quarters and 124 and 4. Diamond Man, Major McIntosh, the fast lane, goes to the far outside. Eighth of a mile to come for the Governor Ryan Trophy. Into the stretch, Diamond Man, chased by Major McIntosh. Rattle and Rock, desperately hunting an open lane. He hasn't found it yet. Here he comes, but the wire's coming quickly. Diamond Man, hanging on. Diamond Man wins the State Fair title by a length. Rattle and Rock was home second, and the fast lane was third and 151. And Wood Farm of Big Rock, Illinois. Not a bad day for Sire Cole Muffler. Five winners on today's program. Joe Hampton, Director of Agriculture for the State of Illinois, will be presenting the trophy on behalf of Governor George H. Ryan. To the winning connections. Before he gets away, let's see if we can grab Brian Penske. Get a word with him as right now he confers with the caretaker, Brian. Some final instructions there. Come on over here a moment. Brian, good to see you. This is always a fun place to meet, huh? That's yeah, a good place to meet. Brian being congratulated by the co-breeder, Terry Hunt. Brian, first of all, a lot of people were talking on paper. What do you think about the talent of this year's three-year-old pacing crop? This is not a bad bunch. Oh, it's a pretty deep group. Uh, looks like everything, uh, you know, whoever gets the best trip got the best shot to win uh, with this group. And uh, they've been playing uh, back and forth all season as to who's the best. And uh, we're just glad that we had our shot at it uh, for a little while anyway. So often we think of track position being important on a half mile track. Even on a big track like the Illinois State Fair, for example, your decision to go to the top when you did fairly early in the race, can track position still be important here? Oh, definitely. Uh, everybody was kind of playing a chess game out of the gate as to who was going to be up front and who was going to position themselves uh, around the favorites. And it uh, looked to me like I was going to be their first over, so I went ahead and moved them right onto the front. Not a bad move because you're a winner. Brian, congratulations. Thanks again, Kurt. Brian Pence.